Hi guys, welcome back. I should have made this video for the longest of time, but I don't know. I just feel like I go carry the baby a lot of things. End of the beginning, they say, is always more memorable than the starting. And this, my friends, is the end of my beginning. On this day, I decided to take myself out to shop by to my friend just to have fun and just have a good view and enjoy the environment. It's actually something I've not been to before. But while you watch this whole clip of various events that have happened in my life for the past six months, I'm going to tell you all the story and I just want you to enjoy it while you watch the clip, right? So earlier this year, or let's say late last year, I've had so many plans for myself, right? I had a lot of goals and, and achievements I wanted to, a lot of goals and aspirations I wanted to achieve. And in my head, that felt like if I can achieve all of these said goals, then I'll be the most happiest person in the world, or I'm going to just be so glad and happy with myself. There were about five of them, right? And... <laughs> I'm going to try and mention the ones I can mention, right? And keep out the ones I don't feel I want to mention. So one of my goals first was to um, make a 5.0 GP, right? This was something that I thought was just really far-fetched. I've had people talk about this while in school talk about how they were able to make a 5.0. So you're not in Nigeria, you know, you a 5.0 GPA is more of like GPA between grade point average, like getting A's in all your courses for the semester. This is something that I always felt like really hard in my widest imagination, right? Okay, fast forward to my year five first semester, I was able to make this 5.0 GP and that was just, the feeling was just so beautiful, right? And I told myself before now that I don't want to do this thing once. I want to be able to get it once. I want to do it the second time. Now, this thing that happens when you get to see things before time or you see snippets of things before time, it just loses the whole essence of the whole thing, right? So I had gotten to see my second semester result. And I thought I thought I just lost all level all essence that just lost all essence that it had right it just didn't it just didn't have so much i didn't i didn't get so much joy from it as i thought i would have so i made so that was my second goal for the year make to 5.0 gp which i did right and the next one for me was to leave school with a first class gp cgpa that was something that I just didn't really feel I was able going to do that because what when I started off studying mechanical engineering in the university, my first semester in school as a fresher, I was unable to even make a first class GP. So in my mind, I just felt like making a first class GP was off the limit for me, something I would never be able to do. But I was able to meet this milestone for myself right right from my first semester after I my first semester I already knew I was going to achieve this milestone so it didn't feel like something to worry about again and that was my third um, milestone for the year to make a first class GP and one of the milestone I had for the year right was to have a lot of savings not like a lot of savings but to save up before leaving school I've always wanted to be able to say oh yeah I have seven figures it's just something that I just wanted to do right and that was something I had worked so hard for I worked so hard for it throughout my stay in school and I was able to leave school with seven figures and that really meant a lot to me aside that I've always wanted to leave school with having um having a job ready or having a job for me at least in at least six figure job like that's something i've always wanted to leave school with i've always wanted to have that i've always hoped to have a position that i would just hop on to after school and that was one of the milestones one of my my milestones for the year that i'm going to get a job before i leave school and yes i also was able to seek this and the last thing for me was right to be able to rent my own apartment and stay alone and that was the most recent achievement I just made, right? 
But with all of this, one would expect that I would be so much happy or I would be like the happiest person in the whole world. But believe me when I say that, if it does not make any difference, right? I still feel the same way. I feel, I feel happy, yes, I was able to do this, but I, there's not like a degree or an, a, an extra level of happiness that comes with this. Most times we tend to, we tend to, um, we tend to tie our happiness based on material achievements. And we all, in our head, we just feel like if we're able to make this, um, if we're able to make this material achievement, that we're going to be the most happiest person in the whole world. And that's just what we tell ourselves and we'll go by. But in reality, I get to realize that, I got to realize that all of these material achievements might not necessarily make you happy and happiness comes from deep within you i'm glad i was able to achieve all of this much to why but i'm learning every day to be happy with myself i'm learning to just be able to look back at everything i've been able where i'm where i'm coming from and where i am and just be happy my spirit myself a friend of mine had once told me about how was that we love these things you say trust me when i say if you achieve this thing it's not going to make any difference i thought it was only blabbing to me right but yeah this is me right with all my milestones for the year achieved even before the end of the year right but i still feel the same way i still feel not like i'm not i still feel the same the same level of happiness i felt even before achieving all of these things which means this thing didn't really change me as i thought it would it didn't give me some extra sort of um feeling like i thought it would anyways i'm just going to allow you guys to enjoy the rest of the clip i'm happy just talk about this so this was when we had um enjoy Very mechanical. As far as my photo stand is open for you, so have fun, enjoy, get rid of yourself of the stress. So uh, I wish you have a good time over here. Yeah, thank you all.
this beautiful package from a friend and he attached this note there and I'm just looking forward to reading it. I really don't know what it is but yeah I think this gift came perfectly because I said feel down today and oh it's just too late. I'm just going to read it out right. I'm just going to read the note. Okay.